Economic effects of the coronavirus are being felt right now all across the district. Industries like tourism, wedding planning, hospitality, wellness, the arts, and a host of others have begun to take heavy losses, resulting in businesses having to make some drastic decisions that will and are impacting hundreds of lives. To put it simply, the layoffs have begun. The restaurant and entertainment industries have been hit especially hard following guidelines issued by the mayor's office closing nightclubs and ordering that bars and restaurants shut down their dine-in service and have takeout only. This, coupled with the advice given to the public by health experts to avoid crowds and to generally stay in, means a lack of income for these establishments, which means a lack of need for employees. All your favorite D.C. staples are caught up in this. Busboys and Poets had to lay off hundreds of employees from their multiple establishments. One that's near and dear to my heart, the D.C. Improv, had to close its doors for an undetermined amount of time, laying off 50 people, almost the entire staff. I haven't heard about Ben's Chili Bowl yet or any of the other spots around the district we all enjoy, but I'm sure the news won't be good. And this is just the immediate employees. We haven't begun to discuss the vendors that supply these places, as well as the people who make the deliveries. Some single, some with families, all with financial responsibilities that have to be met. Now, in response to this, a virtual tip jar was started online for service industry workers. To date, more than 2,200 local employees have registered there looking for help. When this moment in time finally ends, some of these establishments will be back, but many, sadly, will not. And in the meantime, all of these lives will be turned upside down. My hope is that when this time comes to an end, and it will, that we'll take from it the fact that we're all connected. We're all bound together, even if we don't see the strings between us. Maybe in the future we can remember this and treat each other accordingly. Until then, try and keep these people and each other within your thoughts. We're all we got. We're going to continue this conversation online. And remember, you can stay up to date on our app and website. Have a beautiful Thursday. Get up, DC.